Now we have the latest death-defying feat by Nick Walenda. You'll remember he crossed over at Niagara Falls last year in a dramatic and record-setting feat. Well, now he's done it again, except this time he walked 1,500 feet over a gorge near the Grand Canyon in Arizona late Sunday. No safety net, no harness, and high winds whipping all around him. Praise you, God. It was the pulse-pounding, heart-stopping walk of his life. Filled with words of prayer, Nick Walenda put his life now, literally on the line Sunday night to be the first person to cross a gorge near the Grand Canyon. Help me to relax, Lord. With no feet? safety harness, Good. just his win. skill and balance, yeah, the 34 year old inched right his thing. way across Hell yeah, Hole Jesus. Bend an area known as the Little Grand Canyon, just east of the Grand Canyon National Park. It's kind of hard to relax when you're 1,500 feet above a canyon. Walenda was slow and steady, surviving on just a two-inch wide cable, 1,400 feet long. That's more than a quarter of a mile and 1,500 feet off the ground, higher than the Empire State Building. Winds are way worse than I expected. Battling winds of up to 30 miles an hour, there was no shortage of nail-biting moments Jogging and hopping the last few steps, emotions flooded to the surface after Walenda made history again. It took every bit of me to stay focused that entire time. After his big finish, the seventh generation flying Walenda took a moment to honor his great grandfather Carl, who died performing a similar stunt in 1973. He's a huge inspiration to me. I'm carrying on a legacy, and this is in my blood. It truly is. After seven generations, it's in my blood, and it's such a huge honor to be able to carry on the legacy in a huge fashion like this. He's not done yet either, Robin. He mm. says if he gets permission, he wants to do it right here in New York between Empire State Building and the Chrysler Building. Ooh, I don't know if oh, he's going to get that permission. <laughs> but it's, again, like when we saw him with you in, yeah. in Niagara Falls, to hear him praying, to hear yeah. him, you know, I, I love that they have the mic on him and you can just hear what he is saying the entire yeah. time and what his family must be going through watching him. Oh, I'd be running at the end too. Yeah. <laughs> he has to focus every yes. single fiber of his being uh -huh. onto that wire. Oh. He, is, he is something else. All right, man. Indeed. Thanks for bringing that to us.